morning. Welcome to my class. <laughs> all right, so this is my class. This is where the magic happens. And I have, this is where I post all my anchor charts. My students can reference to them, can look at them. It's visual for everybody. So they can, every time they need help, they can look at them. This is where I post my LOs and DOLs. This is a dual language school, so they're in both languages, in English and Spanish. Up there, they have the higher thinking questions that I use, and they're across the room. So they can, whenever I'm using higher thinking questions, they know which one I'm using, and I want them to be accountable and use them as well. Uh, this is my data wall. This is where I post um, how they're doing. Every, every Friday, we take a test, and the, the, the score is getting here. It's color coded, so it's very easy for me to know uh, who's struggling, who needs a little, bit, a little bit of a push, and who's doing great, and they, they don't need any, any extra help. This is where I store all the manipulatives, and I'm planning on having a lot more, a lot more because I just uh, was granted a junior league grant uh, of almost $2,000, so I'm planning on these supplies to grow a lot more and be able to buy a lot more manipulatives for, for my students. This is uh, flexible seating, so they, this is a PBL uh, classroom. They work on project-based learning and they are independent, they have their computers. This is a motivational wall. I want them to know that, they, that I believe in them. I want them to feel inspired and I don't really do anything with it, but I, I hear my students talking among each other, uh, be a leader and uh, be forgiving. And, and this is where I post all, my, all the work as well and I always have my, my um, schedule whenever they get into the classroom. The jam, which is the general about math, the immediate do now, uh, is posted on the board so they don't have to get any instruction. They, they get in the classroom, they greet me and they sit down and start working. Then there's absolutely no, no uh, loss of time. This is the interactive board. I, I use it a lot because we use a lot of videos, interactive games. And this is a dual language school, so I have my uh, Spanish and my English word wall. I make sure that I post all the words that we're learning in Spanish and in English, so to make sure that they are bilingual, bilateral, and bicultural. Um, this is this pop popcorn machine. I use it for, for rewards uh, every time. They do something fantastic. They, they need to be rewarded. We like to be rewarded as adults, and they love to be rewarded as, as, as kids. This is my small group. Sometimes I put my small group in here, and that small group I use it too, because I tend to, I want to grow leaders in my classroom, and I want them to help me out, and I know that they are capable of doing that. So sometimes I have a small group, and somebody else is teaching another small group, so they are a cannibal, and they're, they're all, we are a family here. We're growing each other. No, there's nobody left behind. And this is the Bravo board, so this is where I post all the magnificent work, and they're very proud to see the work in there. And this is my math content wall, where I see where they, they can reference to it again, see all the words, all the content we're learning. And the, the way the class is arranged in groups is because we use a lot of table talk, uh, accountable talk, and team working. So I want the, the, the groups, the way they're assembled is by a mix, mix level. So uh, you might find a very high student with a very low ones and maybe some middle, and they're helping each other and they're, they're accountable for each other and they're raising each other. Nobody's left behind again. And this is my classroom. <laughs>